Hey guys, welcome to a brand new video for the Elder Scrolls for Oblivion Max Difficulty. Uh, we just found Exidian. I'm probably pronouncing it wrong, but I'm not too sure. Um, never mind. Uh, yeah, so here I am. And he's told me that he wants me to do something. I genuinely can't remember what. I'm just gonna kill these guys. Uh, I'm gonna pretty much stop looting now because I don't really feel like I need to anymore. Uh, the only thing I really spend money on is po po poisons and stuff. So, ah, here we go. I've entered Exidian. I should now begin locating for the focus crystals. That <laughs> that link the res resonator. Oh yes, the resonator of judgment with the rest of the dungeon. Yeah, okay, the grim arch and all that. Yeah, okay, good. Uh, it's opened elsewhere. Press that button there. Nice one. Okay, down the steps. And. Okay, let me see if I can remember what to do. I am quickly running out of poisons. So I think what I'm going to do now is mainly just get out the old uh, Daybreak and get them as much as I can to try and help. But. You know, I am dead with long sword. It does 20 damage of harm. I really don't think that my creatures get that I'm going to be doing too bad, especially with my creatures. So I may not have to use poison as much anymore, at least for now. Nice. It's going quite well actually. I, mean, I seem to be tanking the hits. The only things I wasn't tanking the hits from were them. Shuffler things, I think they were called. They were like the skeleton things, but it doesn't matter. Right, get me through here. Thank you. Uh, down the steps. Is this the one where you have to drive people crazy, or is it not? I can't remember. Quite early on. Hey. This one. It's gonna be like the first mission I have to do. Not, we've got a lot more to do that one. That's a fun one though. Oh. Anyway, yeah. Yeah, like as you can see I'm like actually tanking these here. I'm not doing a lot of damage man. But if I could get myself on the right sword, I could enchant the sword. I could do some serious damage. I have a zero star, so pretty much makes a close up with that. That's all he's got. Wow, okay, he did quite a bit of damage to me there. And then, um, yeah, I'm gonna get him out and then I'm just gonna heal up a little bit. I think he's trying to silence me, I don't know. So he's a bum out shame and pain right now, right? Okay, he's getting poisoned. I don't care if my dog is back down, he's quite a strong one. There we are. Yeah, it was a waste of poison, but ah, there we are. Focus crystal added. Nice. I've discovered the first of three crystals, focus crystals. It was affixed at the top of Grum, Grum Knight Shaman's crystal staff. I think they are using the power of the crystal as a source of power for their weapons. Now that I've removed it from the staff, I should place the focus crystals in its judgment necklace and continue. Nice. Can't wait when enemies are nearby, that's fine. Yeah, I'm just trying to heal up as best I can. And there we are. I've placed the first focus crystal into the Nexus. I can now continue to search for the focus crystals. Sound. And the door's just opened up. Just want to make sure I'm at full health before I continue. It does take absolutely ages to get my health back now. But I'll just make sure I'm like prepared and ready for this. I'm close to level 50 with my armor skill as well, which is going to be sweet. Which is, it, I mean, I suppose that's like part of the reason I've put up enchanting my, my uh, sword. Basically, because I'm unable to repair it. But I ne I'm nearly there. I'm nearly there. Whoa, there's a lot of guys there. Uh, what the hell is going on here? That deserves a screenshot. Right. One. Two. Um. I don't want to use poison on these guys. I really don't feel like it's worth it. They don't pack enough punch to 
uh, really caused me too much grief, especially when my days were out. So. See, I'm actually tanking the hits really well, even though I'm not doing a lot of damage to them. And, when every time they hit me, it reflects some of the damage. I think that's how it works. Maybe not all the time, but, you know, it's like 20 something percent of the time, they get damage reflected back at me. Which is absolutely sweet. Okay. Hmm. Right, where to go now? Still worshipping these toilet up things. But that's none of my business. Let's repair everything again. I'm really pushing for this uh, level 50 with armor. I really am. It just would mean I could use enchanted weapons and armor, which is absolutely amazing. And if you're wondering why I haven't done that so far, whoa! Uh, that's why. Okay, good. Yeah. So others haven't survived that fall, but I did, and I survived. Harvested a withering moon, which is sweet. So there's uh, some cool stuff in here. And there's a metal door, and another good night warrior. Oh, this one's a torturer. There's two of them, okay. That's fine, I can deal with that. Let's kill these guys, we are methodical then. And the armor skill is pretty good. I haven't done that in a long time, actually. Nice, we're doing well here, actually. I'm doing decent damage to them as well. I mean, my data obviously does a hell of a lot more damage. But, we are doing it. We're getting it. And now, now we've got no shield and no data. It's great. Nice. So I think that, sh that shield spell puts me up to 85, which is the maximum you can get. So, it's pretty sweet. I do want Daedra armor, but I can't wait till I get that. Full set of enchanted Daedra armor, I'm going to be absolutely unstoppable. I do want it enchanted though with um, resist magic spells and stuff. That would be the ideal situation, so uh, that's, probably, that's why I'm like waiting until I'm like high level. Or like stuff with like black magic. But, I mean, we'll see what happens. I'm not 100%, but I believe I have to maybe be a vampire in order to even get that spell. So, oh wait, no, I was just going to use Sigil Stones, wasn't I? Yeah, oh, that's fine, yeah. I use Sigil Stones, but I'll wait till I'm level 25 before I go ahead and do that. And, uh, oh yeah, I need the crystal, don't I? Where is the crystal? It should be on one of their corpses. There it is, on the flame stalk. Nice. I have discovered the second focus crystal. I should place it on the nexus and continue. I've got to be honest, so far, not really having a bad time with this. Um, seems to be doing alright, even without poisons, which is always good. I'm just going to heal up here real quick. Um, repair my items. There we are. Finally, I can repair magical items and stuff at long last. So now I can start thinking about maybe enchanting sword with, you know, it could even be like weakness to poison, it could be anything. Um, I'm hoping to do one with like weakness to magic and then like fire damage with like stupid amounts or something, that would be, that would be really good. I could do uh, lightning because none of the races are resistant to lightning. So. Probably would be my best bet, but I haven't really decided yet what I want to do with that. There's another two Rum Knight Warriors here. I have to keep reminding myself this is max difficulty because, fair enough, yes, I ever did it with me, you know, but their attacks aren't doing a lot of damage, and I am a surviving this, so. Um, yeah, yeah. So, this is a Rum Knight Pain thing, yeah. And I'm actually doing okay against it. I am, however, going to use Mara's Milk. I know some people get one today, but you know, why not? Yeah. If you've got it, flaunt it. So. Nice. <coughs> Excuse me. 
I was just gonna say, I don't remember where I got the noise mode from. I know it came on very useful. Um, I think more so on the earlier levels, but I don't remember when I got it. Right, Amber. Huh, right, okay, so we're not at the crystal location yet. I must remember to keep quick saving. Just if I die, I don't want to be sent like miles back, do I? So, um, repair some more. Probably be repairing a lot more if I can now. Just because I can repair my shield, and it always helps to have a high repair um, armor skill, doesn't it? So, here's another one. Grum Knight Warrior, Grum Knight Pain. Painbringer, that's the one. Ah, I was nearly right. I don't think any of them are actually called just the Grum Knight Warrior. They all just them differently days on them, so. Oh, my data is fighting more. So I am the only one that's hit this guy so far. And you can see I'm actually doing okay. His agility is absolutely appalling. And he can't hit me, which is great. Um, right. Yeah, nice one. Don't get me wrong, it takes a long time to want to finish him off. But it's possible. It's definitely possible. Let's finish this guy. Because I don't really have poisons now. I have a few. But none I want to waste. I think I came at the Shivering Isles with like 30 poisons. And now I have like 6 or 7, I think. Maybe. I couldn't have more than like 15 anyway. Hmm. Oh, yeah, need to heal. And there's another one coming. Where is he? Ah, oh, there he is. This will be where the third focus crystal is, I reckon. So, uh, shields up. Nice. Right, it would be nice if me and my data could work together to take one down, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. Shields up. Yeah, my data does a hell of a lot of damage to them, actually. So yeah, it's a really good choice. Scrum Knight Crudgel or whatever that was. Scrum Knight Egg. Why do they just carry eggs of, like of their young around with them? That's weird. Someone should tell them that it's weird. Anyway, Scrum Knight Torturer. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, here we go. Finish him off. Which one of them has it then? Is it this guy? Nice. Oh, he's not dead. Now he is. What the hell was that? Never mind. I'm gonna let me Daedrus deal with whatever's around there and I'm just gonna heal up for a little bit. Get myself back on top. Oh, there we go. Ah, that is. Whoa, whoa, holy hell. That was not good. He needs to not do that anymore. Okay, he really needs to stop doing that. Nice. That was ridiculous. Uh, yeah, nice one. Maybe it'll let me wait. Okay, I've discovered the third focus crystal. Sweet. Back to full health. Has. Yep, nice. Right. So, I saw the crystal site was just up here. Just gonna quick save so I don't lose my progress. Wouldn't like that. Uh, yeah, there we are. I placed the third and final focus crystal under the Judgment Nexus. The path of the restoration of Judgment itself is now clear. My next task should be to attune, attune the Restorator by using the. I bloody hell, some big words here. A Junator of Judgment that Shea Gorath has provided me. Okay. <clears throat> I can do that. I think. Yeah, I should probably should should be okay. Let's go. I hope it's not too far away. I need to prepare my stuff as well. There's another guy down there as well. So I'm gonna have to deal with him. Yeah, well, there's two of them, right? Oh, there's three of them. Okay. Do you know in this situation, poisons might be necessary. So I'll use a poison on one of them. 
that I'll kill him. Then I'll help my Debra through on this one. Nice. And I'll help my Debra through on this one as well. While the other one is just slowly dying. Which would be great. Nice. There's two down. Magnasaur, yeah. We do want Magnasaur. We want all the Magnasaur we can get, to be fair. Any of them have minus or oh, we're taking it. But you'll see why later on. So, eight, five, there we are. And. No. Don't want that. <clears throat> right, so it's through here. I hope I'm not backtracking. Oh, I'm not. Excellent, right. Okay, there's three here as well. I think same, same deal as last time. Hit one with the poison, fight the other two properly. Okay, so he's a torturer. I think really whichever one doesn't have uh, magic. Well, saying that, it should be like the one that's with magic, or should be the one that will fall, because that's where the most uh, damage comes from. So that poison basically just killed that one. Oh, sorry about that. I accidentally just hit my own Daedrus. Now he's staggering me, which is really annoying. But they're not doing a lot of damage to me either, so that's quite, that's quite all right, I suppose. Okay, another hit. Another one. Oh, I thought I'd be killing him soon, but I guess not. There we are, he's dead now. Heal up. And there's a big crystal there. There we are. Resonator, Restorator of Judgment. Okay, the Resonator of Judgment has been attributed. Whatever that said, I should now make my way back to Shay Gora. See what this does. Nice, 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 nice. Okay. So I think I'll uh, head back to Shay Gora now, guys, and I'll uh, catch up with you when I get there. Let's just see what's in this chest. Is that it? 57 gold. Hardly worth my time. There's something here as well. Oh, okay, so this takes you back to Exilium. Okay. Nice. Finally, Lord Sheagoreth has sent oh, someone to assist me. But where are my manners? <clears throat> Must get into my professional tone. <clears throat> Welcome to Zedillion. I'm the dungeon caretaker, Kiliban Nerendil. Okay, tell me about this place. A wonder of engineering, is it not? Zedillion is the ultimate test of metal for the foolhardy adventurer that dares trespass into the Shivering Isles. What they don't know is that they're being drawn to their doom, courtesy of the Resonator of Judgment. Uh, okay, um... How do I get off out of here? Yes, yes, I, I tend to ramble. You'll have to forgive me. If you have the attenuator, then Sheagorath must have sent you. Zedillion would normally have sent you back to the entrance when you stepped on the pad in the resonator chamber. Since you're up here, I can only surmise that adventurers are already entering the dungeon as we oh, speak. Oh, yes, this is the one. Uh, what should I do? The only thing we can do is let the adventurers complete a cycle through here. I'll be glad to help. I nice. assume Sheagorath gave you the Manual of Zedillion. You can consult it for more information, or I can provide instructions. Okay. Right, I know so what he's on about. This quest is a hell of a lot of fun, but we'll do that next time, guys. So I'll leave it there for a day. Thank you very much for watching, please like, subscribe and all that good stuff and I hope to see you next time. Take care guys.